friends welcome to dynamics optima today our topic is creation of collection letters in dynamics 365 f and o uh, the purpose of creation of collection letters is the speedy recovery of overdue balances from customers now we are going to learn how to create and send the collection letters to customers. The creation of collection letters will be under created and collection module. Create and collection module, module is a sub module of account receivable. So now I am going to create and collection module and collection letters as you can see here collection letters now the first step is set up collection letter sequence so there are already letters created anyhow we will create new sequence letter okay usmf anything you can give sequence collection Description is your chance. Collection and letters. Okay. Now save it. Now collection letter code. Code means the first letter, second letter, third, and fourth letter, the sequence. So you are sending now first letter. So you can give it your description as reminder one. So the currency and the main account. The main account is the revenue account. This is for the account where you want to uh, account the charges collected from customers. Okay. So I think the other revenue account we have it. So we can give the other revenue account. So if I am charging fifty dollars to the customer for uh, late payment this late payment will go to main account 401300 and item shelter group is not required if you want to charge any taxes on this particular fee then you can fix it otherwise you can leave it minimum minimum overdue balance minimum overdue balance means for example some customers will have a very minimum amount as a may, may might be 50 dollars or 100 dollars so uh, management or uh, company owners is not bothered about collection collecting 50 dollars or 100 dollars so you can fix it and more than 100 dollars minimum if you fix it so collection letter will be created only for the balances who is having uh, hundred dollars and above so now days what is what is the days days is nothing but the overdue days for example uh, november 30th is uh, due customer due so i am fixing two days so if i am fixing two days november 30 december sec first and second the collection letter will be created and sent to the customer okay so don't bother about block if you block it no activity will be happened in the into that particular customer okay now i am adding collection letter sequence two this is second matter if the customer fails to send the payment by even even though receiving first reminder then second collection letter will be generated and sent to the customer as a sec reminder one reminder two hey. reminder two okay the account will be the same account will be the same and you can fix the charges 100 so because 
overdue days is increasing and the customer is not uh, responding so this will again it will be the same hundred dollars this is another five days we can give it okay so add one more sequence selection level three reminder three Three with others, same account four zero one three hundred and the fee you can increase to two hundred. Tax group not required. This is again under another seven days you are giving time. So this done. Add one more sequence letter fourth, and this is final reminder. Final reminder. reminder. So four zero one three hundred. The fee in currency is you can three hundred. This is again hundred dollars. Okay, this is ten days. Now save it. Now the next step is we have to assign the company collection letter sequence in customers posting profile now we will go to account receivable posting profile general actually you don't need to assign collection letter sequence to prepayments because uh, prepayment is nothing but uh, before uh, placing order, you will receive payment, so no dues will be there. So only general, you have to fix it. And we can take our sequence. Yes, collection letter. Okay, interest code, article, save it. I and even 90 group also you can fix it. Now again we go to create and collection module. We will create collection letter. Invoice, create notice, payment is interest. If you want to charge interest, you can keep it. And uh, collection letter, collection letter per customer. Collection letter date, today I'm giving general account. Okay. So filter, filter the Filters will help you to select the particular customer or all the customers. I will take US001. Okay. Let us see. You will get a notification here. Yes, perfect. The customer account is 001 collection letter 23 with collection letter code 4 for customer US 001 created. Now we can go to same module, uh, create in collection. You can review and post the collection letter. You can filter customer account US001 apply. So what is the letter we have created now? 12. Okay, this is the one. 
why the collection letter 4 has been created the customer due date has been surpassed already one to three collection letters okay so now the fourth letter means final remainder has been created now you can see you can print it collection letter note and see Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. See, collection letter P because the collection, this is the fourth collection letter. So we have charged collection letter P 300 for fourth letter. So it's automatically picked by the system. So this is the standard format of collection letter. If you need any customization, you can make it. Okay, logo, company logo, or format or something if you want you can change it uh, so this is the final and uh, uh, collection letter and after reviewing you can post it so check the posting date when you want to post it and click ok so the posting charges will be posted to customer account and as well as your revenue account Once it is posted, you can see the posted button here a little. Now it is posted. So this is the simple process of creation of collection letter in Dynamics 365. Please subscribe Dynamics Optima for more uh, updates. You can subscribe and you can contact us for any F and O training functional. There is no coding required. Any one can join this course. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.